Wow. And I thought Shandu was an odd burg. Look at this place. The spirit faith is stronger here in Ajul than it is in Rashagal. Wow, check those out! That's something you won't see anywhere else in the world. It's one of Kanbalar's famous mountain slide cars. What are they? Kanbalar was built along the peaks of a mountain range. Those slide cars connect the multiple districts together. Don't they look fun? I bet we could see forever in one of those. How do we go about meeting the king? I'll request a royal audience for you when I seek permission to use the wyverns. Don't get your hopes up, though. Many people come to the capital seeking an audience, so you may need to wait a bit. I suggest resting at the inn until I get back. I bet right now you're trying to think of a way to do things without Jurgen's help. Uh, just try not to make trouble for him, okay? He's a nice guy. <laughs> Okie dokie, so welcome to Kanbalar. I am pretty hungry here. How long has it been since I've had one of Mom's home You know what? No, no, I'm just gonna go. Okay, we're just gonna continue on with the story a little bit, and uh, we'll get some more story out of the way. Then we'll start doing the side quests. Thank you for braving it out for three hundred bucks. Jurgen still isn't back. Not yet. Elise, want to do some sightseeing? <clears throat> Miss Elise, why not join Leia? Come on, Elise. Gosh, now that Tipo's giving us the silent treatment, I guess I need to pick up the slack. You, talk more than before? Impossible. Meh. Hey, just because Tipo's gotten quiet doesn't mean you have to. I'd love to hear more about you, Elise, in your own words. Shut up, Leia. You're the one holding us all back, after all! Huh? Elise, that was uncalled for. You should apologize. You must have really crossed the line if Mama Mila's scolding you. I hate Mila! And Leia, too! Hey, where are you going? Ouch! That stung a little, not gonna lie. Please. Do not let it get to you. Uh, oh, I I'm fine. We need to get Elise back. Oh, snap! Elise be pissed! <laughs> okay, we gotta go find her now. Before we can rest comfortably in bed. And all that fun stuff. Ah, random guard! I'm sorry, that happens almost every time you leave the inn. <laughs> So I know about him. Anyways, let's go over this way. We'll reach another little district here. And we see people on the horizon. <laughs> no reason to be alarmed. This is purely a chance encounter. Nothing more. Elise, I'm sorry about before. I can't imagine how lonely you must be without the old Tipo. I know I have a bad habit of opening my big mouth without thinking. Please forgive me. No. Come on, don't say that. I'll beg if I have to. I thought you and Mila were my friends. I hate you. I hate you. Can't you see that I'm just worried sick about you? Liar. You don't care about me at all! I don't want to be friends anymore! Miss Elise... Everyone is being kind to you right now because you have them so concerned. You say that you feel hurt, but have you considered your own actions? Do you realize that Tipo's words were just as hurtful to Miss Leia? I hurt Leia? Well, hurt is a strong word, but you took the wind out of my sails, that's for sure. I had no idea. 
Why don't you try apologizing to her? But I said such horrible things. I am certain she will forgive you if you ask nicely. Forgiveness is the sign of a true friend. Leia, I'm sorry. Will you forgive me? Sure, but under one condition. From now on, I want you to tell me more about yourself using your own voice. Huh. You're not the boss of her. You're only three years older. Tipo, stop! Elise? Yes? Even if it's only three years, I'm still older than you. Right. Bossy Leia, scary Leia! <laughs> There's a lesson here, child. Never take your friends for granted. So what do we do now? Jurgen still hasn't gotten back yet. We could just barge into the castle ourselves. For the hundredth time, let's not cause any trouble for Jurgen. That's no good? Hmm. It sounded like a good idea to me. Yep. And Elise just did a complete 180. I think that was a little... That one, that scene kind of bugs me how fast she, like, forgave everyone that quickly. That, that just seemed like a little out there. But anyways, Elise on censor! Tipo, please! Stop saying mean things to Leia! But that's on you, Elise! No! I don't want to insult my friends! But at the bottom of your heart, don't you want to? No! You're wrong! Don't say things like that! Bad, Tipo, bad! Hey, take it easy, you two! But Tipo's been saying horrible things! It's alright, I don't mind. Always meddling with us just because you're a few years older! But... But I like it when Leia meddles. Yep, she really does feel that way. Oh, thanks, Elise. Guess I'll keep right on meddling then. Yay, awkward stuff. A sign of... Oh, this is... Okay, this one's kind of funny. A sign of affection. Jude, we're such great pals! <laughs> hey, why do you always chomp my face? As a sign of affection. I've never seen Tipo get so close with anyone else before. So that was like a Tipo kiss. It was? My first kiss was stolen by Jude? <gasps> stolen? That should be my line. I can't believe I'm having this conversation with a puppet. Don't be coy, Jude. You have to take responsibility. Oh, Jude. Responsibility? Responsibility for what? <laughs> oh my god. The eaves of the houses. The snow on the roofs could tumble down on you. Oh my god, I got a lot of scenes now. Tipo drain. Oh, that was good eating. Tipo, what exactly is it that you absorb from foes? I'm not really sure. It's like their energy or enthusiasm. Is that nutritious? Beats me. But when I'm hungry, before I know it, I'm chowing down. You really are a peculiar creature. What does enthusiasm taste like? It depends on the person. For example, yours tastes like strawberries. What? When did you absorb mine? I don't need to absorb it to know. I can just tell. Huh. That does sound appetizing. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh... Tipo makes for some interesting conversations. Anyways, talk to this girl. Excuse me, have you seen a repig around here? I've been raising her for my wedding, but she ran away. What am I supposed to do? It's a tradition in my clan to serve roast repig at, at a wedding ceremony. I guess we'll accept. You'll look for her? You'll look? You'll help me look for her? Oh, thank you. I'll look around the city. Can you search the Mount Highlands for me? Sure. Or for her? I don't know. Said something. Uh, oh, there's a doorway over here. Is there actually anything in here? Don't think there's anything side quest related, but there might be a treasure chest or something. What do you have to say? Oh. Spend a lot of type cooped up at him. Oh, there's an item there. Oh, Mysterious Jewel 12. I missed that in the Mila playthrough. I forgot this place was here then. Oh, good thing I came in here. 
Again, I've probably missed a few or something, because I haven't really been keeping... I do have a list, but I haven't been keep, pe uh, paying any attention, so at the end I'll probably just go through my entire list and see which ones I'm missing, if I am missing any. Which I most likely am. Uh, let's pick you up, and... Next up, we want to go back to the inn and sleep again. This isn't storyline related. Right now we're supposed to head to the castle, so... Sleep again, we get a conversation going. It's freezing out there. But you nerd put you're hot now. Thanks, sweetie. You're pretty hot yourself. Huh? Oh ha ha ha. That was so lame. On days like this, I wish I had a nice scarf like Alvin's. I know, right? Apparently basic loose knit scarves are totally in right now. They those in cloud sheep wool earmuffs are this winter's absolute must haves. I like the plaid ones myself. Oh yeah, they are. Those are great, and they'd look super cute with Tipo. I'd go great with anything. Ha <laughs> that you do. You may even inspire a new trend. How could Tipo be a trend when there's only one of him? Hey, quit butting into our girl talk. Yeah. Well, don't set me up uh, by saying nonsensical things. Now, now, Jude. Why not come with me? You so you can uh, enjoy some men's talk instead. Well, shall we speak of love, youth, and friendship? Why, you could, uh, we could chat until the very break of dawn. Uh, I guess so, but whenever we talk about anything, it always turns into you giving me life advice. Hmm, now that you mention it, I don't really have much, uh, have much to discuss except my f for my physical ailments and the life lessons I've learned. Isn't there anything fun we could talk about? Hmm, nothing comes really readily to mind. Wasn't that other thing just the cutest? Oh, it totally was. I thought I was going to die from cute overload. Well, hey, me too, me too. Oh, and I heard that it wasn't even the cutest thing they had. They had something way cuter. I must say, I'm a bit jealous. Yeah. Meh. That's a scene. <laughs> okay. Uh, How did anyone build a city in such a high place? Well, I guess... Maybe it's just more impressive that way. You! Speak to me! The colder it gets, the more monster attacks our people suffer. When nature becomes this harsh, even monsters become desperate to survive. But that doesn't mean you have we have to roll over and take it! We must kill these monsters for the safety of our citizens! I hereby call upon able-bodied hunters to help us in our task! Except... Thank you for all your help, citizen! These monsters hide out in the central region of the Mon Highlands! Your assignment is to wipe out the ones near the Silent Cave! Good luck! Yes, sir. Uh, but we will do that eventually, I guess. <laughs> Just haphazard. Uh, where do we have to go? We need to go back to Shondu. Briefly. Because we should get a back talk about what we need to do here quickly. Back talk, back talk, back talk. There we go. Let's take a. Uh, let's test it back at the hotel. All right, we finally got some heart herb. It should definitely help out with Mila's pain. Yeah, let's hurry on back. Well, let's go to the inn. We could get that out of the way. Inn. And then we just have to rest at the inn. Two hundred gold. I've become much more used to the Asperixis now. But I'm assuming it still hurts. That's what I've gotten used to. <sighs> hey, Jude was so worried about you that he went and found you a hard herb. What's that? It's an extremely rare herb with potent healing abilities. When used during aromatherapy, its effects are second to none. You went to all that trouble for me? It was nothing. Here, let's try it out. Hmm, that smells amazing. I feel so much calmer. How is it? Do you feel any better? Yes, I can feel the tension melting away. Mila? Hmm, I, I can't stop hiccuping. Oh no! 
Oh, you caught my acute hiccup disorder? I kind of doubt that. She's probably just allergic to the hard herb aroma. If it was an allergy, wouldn't she be sneezing? Perhaps this is some unique aspect of Mila's anatomy? I'm sorry. I'll put it out right away. <laughs> this is fun. I've never had hiccups like this before. It makes me forget all about my pain. Thank you, everyone. Oh. N no problem. So, uh, now what? As long as Mila's happy, I say we can move right along. After all, there's no better medicine than laughter. <laughs> exactly. Uh. She's crazy, I tell ya! Ooh, while we're here, actually, I should probably spend some money on recipes. Uh, let's go... What did I use? I used the cheap hundred, and I'll grab one of those. There goes a lot of money. Oh well. Okay. Um. What do we need to do now? We need to go. That finished up the aftermath like side quest. Oh, uh, we need to go to the Mud Highlands, I think. Is there actually, there's something else we were able to do, or is that after the next little bit of story? There's a lot of stuff that pops up after the next little bit of story, so... Um... Okay, I think what we're gonna do now is we are going to go back to... The, uh, Mon Highlands. Uh... Shondu entrance might be quicker? Might be. Can't recall. Either way, we got some more items we could pick up, so I might just, uh... Quickly swipe by and pick some of these up. This one didn't show up in our first playthrough here. Pointy talons. I'll just pick up the ones that are out in the open I can see. I'm not gonna bother going into all the caves or whatever. I'll just pick up the stuff that's on the way. Cause uh money. Money's good. Also I want to expand that weapon shop to get the next tier of weapons as soon as possible. Eighteen hundred gold Buzzard Talons. Oop, that was close. Um this way! Mon Highland Central Region! Oh, it actually shows up on the radar. I didn't know that. You can see one of the objectives to the uh, other side of this rock. More harder! There you are! You must be the centerpiece for the wedding, huh? Oink! Oink! I'm sorry. The bride asked me to bring you back. Oink! Oh, poor thing. We're just bringing it back to be eaten. Mmm. <laughs> Rub pig bacon. <laughs> Okie dokie. Let's grab you. Eliza's song! It's snowing! It sure is. I just thought up a snow song. It snowed last night. It snowed last night. Mila and the four had a pillow fight. Sylph tore up the clouds in sight, tossed down all the feathers white. What a great song! That was perfect. What was that? Elise has a new hobby? Can the voice wasn't that. It was a good, neat little song for a 12 year old. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Next up is you. Mysterious birds! Getting lots of those. Uh, over here. There we go. There's the other four... Enemies we have to kill for the uh, guard. More hard herb. The stuff's really rare, you know. Come on, it hasn't been that long since I fought. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Let's get some fighting in here. Stabby stabby and face punching and all that fun stuff. Did I get cool? That does a lot. Steel actually does quite a bit of damage. And considering it just makes you more powerful after. 
Maybe it uses becomes more powerful during? I don't know. Anyways, let's head back to uh Khan Balar. You You guys are good, and thanks to you, we were able to achieve our objective without incident. The Ajual military hopes you will join us in our duty to protect the powerless once again. Sir! Six grand. Sweet. And he vanished. Cool. Um, and next up, we need to go for pig. Right, the red pig. Uh, actually, uh, before we go, I'm just gonna go buy that weapon from Mila, so I don't... I'm not gonna buy the next, uh, whatever yet, but I'm going to, uh, just do that, and then I'm going to do that, um, yeah, just to make sure everyone's even. Ow. So I don't think I'm actually, I'm probably not actually going to buy any weapons for a little bit anyway. Let's get that one out of the V. Uh, you. I got you a pig. You found her! Oh, thank you, thank you! But it turns out my fiance's family doesn't like her pig meat. So instead of roasting her, she'll come and live with us. Oink! That way we can eat her in a pinch if there's ever an emergency! Oink! <laughs> That's just so mean. <laughs> Give them the hope in the loving home. But fear that you'll be eaten at any moment. Okay, uh, return from that place, return to that place, that, uh, nothing there yet, um, doom. what else is there? Uh, you can take a slide car from here. That leads to the uh, doorway. There's a doorway by the inn. That's where that leads. I believe we are all done and we can go on. Uh, finish Survival of the Fittest. Finish Runaway Red Pig. Um, that one we can't do yet. I think that's everything, so let's keep going. Yep. <laughs>